Good morning, friends, and welcome to our virtual worship with United Church in University Place. My friends in Christ, God is love all the time. And all the time, God is love. Wasn't it lovely to receive that piano solo, the Haran Carol, was in the moon of winter time. Uh, a perspective of our Christmas story from Native American people and um, with some of the visuals of, of winter scenes as well as our theme for Advent, the O Antiphons. Thank you for choosing to take time to connect with God and this community today on this third Sunday of Advent. My name is Kathy Law and I have the, the privilege and um, gratitude of serving as the pastor of this warm and welcoming and faithful congregation. During this time of worship, we anticipate the coming of Jesus throughout these weeks of Advent. And we gather together as a community of faith to lift up the prayers of the people in solidarity with one another. So if you have prayers on your heart, I invite you to turn to the chat um, sometime dur during our worship to, to place those prayers um, there. And following our worship service, we will gather those prayers and be in solidarity with, with one another as we present those prayers to God. If you are worshiping with us um, through Facebook or, or YouTube, please leave us a note to let us know that you've been worshiping with us and any prayers that, that you might have so we might connect with you later in the week. As we worship God on this day and that God has provided for us, remember this, whoever you are and wherever you find yourself on this journey of life and on this journey of faith, know that you are welcome here as part of this worshiping faith community. This year for Advent, we are exploring the ancient liturgy that is known as the great O Antiphons, upon which the Advent hymn is based, O Come, O Come, Emmanuel. If you looked at each verse, you would find seven different titles for the long-awaited Messiah. Emmanuel, Wisdom, Adonai, Root of Jesse, Key of David, Dayspring, Desire of Nations. Today we explore O Come Thou Dayspring and O Come Desire of Nations. We learn about God through scripture, through the ancient liturgy, through our hymnody, and through our own experience. Our Advent series of the O Antiphons is helping us become more familiar with God by understanding scripture, ancient liturgy, and the hymns of the faith. In the ancient world, different cultures lit fires as they waited for the return of the light in the Northern Hemisphere. We light the candles of the Advent wreath to watch and wait for Christ's coming into the darkness of our world, remembering the promises of God in our lives. You might notice a change to our altar this morning, last week, and the week before there were four blue candles, but our candle personified as joyful joy reminded me that we need the pink candle this week and it will be lit for us this morning. In our candle lighting throughout Advent, you will hear the words of scripture from the prophet Isaiah that the ancient O Antiphons were based on. We join the Berry family in our own sanctuary in hearing about two messianic titles as we light our own candles of hope and peace and joyful joy at home. 